So basically what I do is you get the, the jaws of your vise as loose as you can because I'm going to put my fly line in and secure it, it just makes things a lot easier. And all I've done is come in with my craft knife and cut a little quarter inch strip off of there, as you can see. And here is the quarter inch strip. And we're going to attach that to the fly line. Now you're better doing this in a flat surface, which I can't really show you here. Um, but I'll show you when I get into the vice bit. I use my, my, the base of my vice. I've got my fly line here at 10 feet. This is my first hang marker. And you just, I'll quickly do this and then put it in the vice so you can see what's going on. But you're looking to roll the sticky onto your fly line and just roll it on. So you've got there, you can see a little roll of the stuff. Don't worry about edges or anything like that because we're going to we're going to sort anything that's got anything sticking out. So let's go ahead and stick that in the vice. You can see there it doesn't bite into the fly line at all, and that's key. So just hold this under tension, come in, and cut as close as you dare, like so, to the fly line. Just double check everything's the way you want it. Nice there. And then come in with some UV resin, doesn't matter what you use, just use whatever you like. But just make sure that you cover everything and make sure there's no bumps. It doesn't matter if it's lumpy, um, as long as that lump's smooth, it'll run through the rod rings, not a problem. Make sure you get it all over the place. And I'll, I'll obviously show you this once it's finished. You just, you just need a nice smooth join either side. If there's anything there that's not smooth, just come in a little bit more and just make sure you've got a nice smooth connection like that. I think that's looking good my side. Not sure of your side. Yep, spot on. So in with the, the UV. And you're just smoothing all this off. Sorry, hardening all this off. It's smooth as it is. Make sure you come up from underneath, trying to emblaze yourself like I just did. So and that, as you can see, is a perfect join. Nice and smooth for your fly line. Now what I do is I mark this at 10 feet. 20 feet and 30 feet and these are my hand markers very simple very easy to do I'll just take a picture of this right at the end so you can see the join thanks for watching